Welcome back everyone, I am the Depressed Eeyore, and this is Darkest Dungeon with the Scarlet Estate. Alright, it's time to fight the hag. I've done a little bit, the only thing I did differently is I, I'm gonna have um, Eren be in the far back. Reason for this is I've seen the hag grab people and toss them into the pot all the way up to the third person. And the last time I fought the hag, and the one that ended in failure for me off screen, is um, the first thing she did was literally grab my healer and toss her in a pot, which uh, made my life miserable. Because not only could I not heal because she was in the pot, but even when she gets out, once you get out of the pot from knocking it over, you get put in slot one, and you can't heal from slot one as a uh, vestal. So yeah. All right, two of those. Twenty-four food. Yeah, yeah, it might be overkill, but whatever. Uh, we need a torch. Actually, we don't need that many torches. We'll go with six torches, and then with this, we're broke. There's not much we can do about it. I spent so much money on upgrades. But I'm as ready as I can be, really. I think. Maybe. So let's uh, embark and see how things go. And hopefully I didn't forget something. I had collected many rare and elusive volumes on ancient herbal properties, and was set to enjoy several weeks immersed in comfortable study. My work was interrupted, however, by a singularly striking young woman who insisted on repeated calls to the house. I do notice it's one of three, so I'm guessing every difficulty you'll actually learn more about the hag and probably the necromancer in them. Okay. Oh, that's right. Illumination doesn't work back here. So we'll actually swap these two back. I'll swap them the other way once we fight the hag. Because once someone gets grabbed and tossed in the pot, she'll be able to use illumination. Alright. Um, I guess we can head south first. Right off the bat, huh? Alright, shovel it is. Herself. A victim to the spreading corruption. Malformed with misintent. Indeed. Key for the key. Watch it be like the hag right here. No, it's empty. Alright, we'll go right first. Only have one shovel left, which is not good. We're already needing needing to eat. That's not good either. Nice dodge. for flipping my formation. Thank you for missing. Retreating might be an actually good idea, but I'm probably just gonna go with what I got. It's, it's not the end of the world. Oh, you can actually use- oh, that's right, you can use illumination here. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Three. 
right. Yeah, I know you're not doing so well either. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Uh, plus 10% chance to bleed skills, plus bleed resist, and minus 2% crit. I kind of almost want that on my, uh, on Hong Mei Ling. Just didn't mean to do that. Let's, uh, do that. Alright. Well, I'm in a lot of pain. Oh, thank you. I, I wanted more stress. Alright. Well, let's keep going. We're in utter agony. Do you have a chest though? It's not worth the money. Great. At least you resisted. Traps lie in wait. Unsprung and thirsting for blood. Alright. Rather rough start. <laughs> this we can heal from eating food, because our party seems to be getting rather hungry very quickly. Alright, another torch, that's good. Definitely need more of those. Thank you for dodging. Can I get some scouting, please? Thank you. Okay. Well, the good news is we're just going to grab this crate and then get out of here. Because we're done here. And we don't need to waste the shovel, which is good. I've already went through 12 food, and I've gone through 6 five rooms, give or take. I mean, there's been backtracking, but this is why I carry extra food, because of this nonsense. At this rate, I won't even have food for camping. Wow, we're not finding anything besides combat. <laughs> this is gonna hurt. Should've done on the other one, but that's okay. Dead. The bigger the beast, the greater the glory. A 
trifling victory. I could try stun locking and getting some heals off, but I didn't really want to risk it. Especially since I don't know what this room is. The last thing I need to do is debuff myself. Alright. she would get an attack off, but nope. Death waits for the slightest lapse in concentration. I have really bad feelings. <laughs> Go ahead and get some heals going. Okay, you're dead. Need some health. Alright, another shovel, that's good. Two shovels. Alright, we have four shovels. So at least that's good. Wish I could say the same for anything else right now. Hello, battle. Die. Be gone, fiend. Um. Not gonna be able to kill them on one hit, so let's just go ahead and get the heals off. It's been a lot worse. Executed with impunity. All right, D desecrated corpse. Alright, cool. So we got some food back. Alright. Let's see what we can uh Thank you, surprised, that's what we needed. Alright, uh let's go ahead and get the stuns going. In also gets us some illumination. It's not a big deal. As victories mount, so too will resistance. All right, we're on our way. Okay, some more food.
Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Okay. Not the boss. Creatures can be fed. That could not have gone any better. Alright, um I don't have any keys. Blight. Oh well. It's not too bad, it's gonna be six damage. Lockbox. Ooh, one of those. Tough. So now we get additional 10% max HP. Maggots! This expedition at least promises success. No, it doesn't promise anything right now. Blanket fire. Attack from that far. Now we're... such a terrible assault cannot be left unanswered. Okay, not the best of situations. Well struck. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. All right. Empty room. One combat. No collecting, let's go. Alright, well we got a lot of food, thankfully. Just as we went on, so gathered close in tenuous firelight and uneasy companionship. Alright, plus twenty percent damage against a monster size two. Definitely need it. And hope that uh, she doesn't get grabbed. Really have much else to give. Um, light bleed and disease resistance. Reduce your stress, or give you stress resistance rather. You're fine. You're fine. Give you some resistances. And. Uh, 
for the torch. All right, let's rest up. Things are good at the moment. As good as things can be, ra rather. Oh, great. One stunned. Dead. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Okay. I don't have any keys. The light. The promise of safety. No, stop give, casting things on her. Great. Decimated. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, get all our food, final meal stuff taken care of. All right, that's all good. We'll max out our torchlight just in case. I swap those two slots. And purpose is made clear. Lead resistance. Now we'll leave that alone. Okay. Here we go. She doesn't have a lot of HP. You just gotta, you know. Oh wow, you can dodge it! I never knew you can dodge it. I've never seen it dodge before, ever. So that actually kind of threw me in a little bit of a loop because I wasn't expecting that to happen. We'll just attack the pot for now, I guess. Yeah, dodging that pot. Good stuff. that bleed to go in. You have insane stun resistance, so I'm just gonna hit the pot. You have to do you have to hit this thing like 28 times to break it. Alright, now you're going to the pot. So now the formation shifted. Yeah, it's every action, which is really annoying. I'm just gonna take the hits and see if I can just out damage her. Debuff and stress. Get me out of this infernal pot. Of course, you can only attack the pot, that's fine. So far, she's taken like 12 damage. I could go for the pot. Or I can go for her. You're doing great, uh, Mei Ling. Just hold on. You're doing fantastic. Okay, you're deep buffed. Now you have no dodge. Yeah, yeah, the pain. This is the biggest issue. She takes multiple actions, and those count as actions for the cauldron as well. It really makes no sense. And you can't really say, you know, because of video games, because it's actually pretty unfair. Leave her corpse to rot, consumed by the spores she spawned. Hey, look, you're at zero HP. Sacred scroll. Uh, plus 10% stress resistance, plus stress heal, and at death's door she slows down. It's an ancestral special only item. 
Awesome. And this just is a move stone. Whatever. Grab it. I'll grab that. We'll go ahead and uh use the shovel on it. Burn it. Um bandage it. Okay, well I tried everything. Health stone. That's not bad. Alright, cool. Mailing's nearly dead, but that's okay. And you're stressed the shit. Everyone hit level three. Slugger, awesome. Fear of unholy. And hard skin. Okay, cool. Once that our estate was the envy of this land. That caught us up a little bit. Uh, the bad news is we still need to take out the swine prince, which we have not. We don't actually have any low-level characters to do that with. Not the end of the world, but it's still very annoying. Crusader only. Okay, max that out. Alright, what can we do with you, Aaron? Let me guess. We'll only gamble, okay. I can live with that. I actually haven't done anything with the gambling hall. With enough ale, maybe they can be inured against the horrors below. Also, I probably should have kept the uh, portraits. Oh well. This gives me an excuse to. All manner of diversion and dalliance await those who cross the threshold with coin in hand. All right, have fun. I think we're at that point where we can, uh, can I at least grab the stuff? Yes, I can. Oh, wow, is there actually a limit of how many trinkets I can carry? I thought you could scroll down and stuff. All right, in that case, let's, uh, get rid of some of this junk. And rank one. I don't even know what that means. Let's get rid of that. Okay. So let's see what we got around here. So we can now go and fight the next tier if we want to. Champion level five. Yeah. I do have a team of level 4, so that means I probably should go ahead and try this veteran, Necromancer. That'll probably be our next, next little plan. And we honestly don't need this. At all. So, whatever. Let's go Sine. Hey Sine. You've been doing really good. I'll give you a secret scroll because it's, you know, your item. And give you some defenses. There you go. You're all geared up. You. I have 4% crit. It's not really great. But I can get additional accuracy and additional damage. Yeah, 
just get raw damage. Alright, uh... Of course, for... Go with that. Oh, you have a bunch of these. Eh, those aren't bad. So yeah, I, I, I probably had enough. Yeah, I, had, I actually had enough to increase my Instructor Mastery, but I screwed up. That's okay. Honestly, it gives me an excuse to save money at this point. So, it's probably for the best. I want to, I can get, start increasing the number of trinkets that, are, that become available to us. We'll see. Alright, well, I'm now officially caught up with my original save, where I killed two of the bosses. Um, we'll see about killing the Necromancer again. This time a harder version, and we'll use our A-team for it and see how that goes. Yeah, we got some uh, pretty decent teams going. Okay. I am the Depressed Eeyore, and this was Darkest Dungeon. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys later.